Hey everyone, it's in room one, it's Mr. C here. We're doing things a little differently today. This is our math lesson for today, but later in this video, we're also going to piggyback onto the stuff we've been doing in social studies for the last few days, talking about the European Middle Ages. Now, while we're doing that, I'll be answering the question that a few of you asked yesterday that I promised I'd give you the answer to today. So stay to the second half of the video and I'll remind you of the question and then tell you how to answer it for yourself. Now, I'm just gonna quickly review what we talked about yesterday with calculating the area of something, specifically a rectangle. Now, with a regular rectangle like this one, you probably remember that what we do to find the area of this rectangle is we take the measurement of the longer side, that's the length, okay? So that's 10 centimeters. And we multiply times the length of the shorter side, that's five centimeters. And so we multiply length times width, and here's, that's five centimeters times 10 centimeters, and we get an area of 50 square centimeters. Okay, and the square is very important. Okay, five times 10 is 50. Don't forget the square there when you're talking about area, and which here is centimeters. So the answer is 50 square centimeters. Now then, how are we gonna tie this in with the Middle Ages, you might ask? Well, here's how. You probably remember that yesterday we were making this stuff. Oh, 